gap in between um, the next band. I've got to tell you about a little story. Um, I have a friend, his name is Julio, um, and he's now dancing as a, uh, he's a flamingo dancer, um, and he only has one leg. So I'm going to tell you his story, all right? Unfortunately, there's no, never, never mind. Okay, let me just tell you a story. <laughs> Julio grew up on the streets of Madrid. Julio, he lost his leg as a kid, the son of a baker. He was very poor. His leg was sliced off by his dad's oven door. Now it's gone. It's gone. It's gone. It's gone, 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 gone. It's gone. His father could see that this would not do. His oven was ruined. His son had been too. Julio, disgraced, fled from his home. His pockets were empty. He was off on his own. Now he's gone. He's gone. He's gone. He's gone, 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 gone. He's gone. He walked down the streets thinking, what should I do? I'm on my last leg. I used to have two. He looked to his right and the sign caught his eye. Dancers wanted, it read. But was Julio their guy? Yes, he was. He was. He was. He was, was, was. He was, he was. Julio's fame now spread all through the land. That one-legged boy was now a one-legged man. Wherever he went, he was known as the one-legged wonder. Whenever he danced, there was one-legged thunder. And he danced. He danced. He danced. He danced, danced, danced. He danced, he danced. The years they flew by, and Julio grew old. His leg had grown weak, but his spirit was bold. Julio Jr., he said, it's now up to you. As he reached down and removed his one dancing shoe, and he danced, he danced, he danced. <laughs> dance, 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 he danced, he danced. Olay. <laughs> Julio's pretty amazing, you have to admit. <laughs> Thank you for delivering Julio to us. Yeah, no problem. You should meet him sometime.